All right, here we go. We're going with number one and two. Uh, we're talking about the slope, find the slope of this line. Remember, slope is rise over run. All right. So my rise, if I'm moving from left to right here, I go up one, two, three, four, five. Is that right? One, two, three, four, five. Yep. So up five over one, two, three. Well, is five over three. All right, and number two, you'll see that it's just a horizontal line. All right, obviously I'm not going up and down at all. all right? I am going right three, so that's zero over three. Well, the slope is just zero, and that's every single time that there is a horizontal slope or excuse me, horizontal line. All right. Here, it looks like if I'm going from left to right, remember, left to right, I'm going down one, right, uh, one, two, three, four, five. So negative one, right, five, so negative one over five. And here, it looks like I'm just going up. I'm going up one, two, three, four. So it's four over zero, which is undefined. Remember that anytime it's a vertical line, like this, your slope is going to be undefined. All right, uh, I'll keep going. Let's talk about the slope between two points. To find the slope between two points, remember I do y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So I want to label my points x1, y1, x2, y2, and Throw what I know. Y2, negative 10, minus Y1, which is 2. X2, 11, minus uh, X1, which is negative 13, which becomes one big plus, like that. All right. <clears throat> negative 10 minus 2, uh, negative 12. Uh, 11 plus 13, 24. So you get negative 1, half. Always reduce, always reduce, always reduce. X1, Y1, X2, Y2, M equals Y2, which is 19, minus Y1, which is 11, over X2, which is negative 3, minus negative 13, so 1 big plus equals. Um, what, that's going to be 30. Over, excuse me. Ten. is three. Maybe I'll stop here. Oh, no, I'll keep going. We've got some more slow problems. X1, Y1, X2, Y2, M equals 16 minus 16, what? Over 1 minus negative 15, so 1 big plus, which is 0 over 16, which is just 0. Remember, zero over any number, excuse me, is just zero. Try this one. 18 minus 12 over negative 17 minus negative 12. Ooh, great breeze. 18 minus 12 is 6. Uh, 17, negative 17 plus 12 is negative 5. So our slope is negative 6 over Five. Remember, I could write the negative sign on the top or the bottom. It still means the fraction is negative. And I'm going to pause there for this one.